Hello everybody, this is Joey. I'm back playing Minecraft. Er, I guess this is going to be a let's play um, because I'm going to attempt to beat the game. So, somehow. Although I have no idea how to do that really. Uh, but the first thing I need to do is get a sword. So, let me go down here, and find my little cave that I was going to explore, and start mining for some resources. The first thing I'll need is some stone, some cobblestone. And iron. I can't remember. Oh, here it is. So let's go down here and get some cobblestone. Make a stone pickaxe so that I can get some iron. Etc. 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 Okay. So let's go ahead and. Uh, where am I at? Now, that and we'll make some more torches. Make all those torches. All right. Uh, what else do I need to do? I'm gonna need a furnace, so I can go ahead and make that. And that's it for now. So let's go on down. Oh. Get my crafting table. There we go. Oh, there's some iron right there. Easy iron. Let's go. Uh, and even more iron. Neato. So that's plenty of iron. Let's get this coal. That way I can smelt my iron <laughs> and make more torches, which I'm sure I'll need. wooden pickaxe sucks, but I, I hate to waste stuff, so, um, I'm gonna use it until it's gone. It won't take long. It, wooden pickaxes suck. Oh, man, this is a big coal vein. broke. Too bad, so sad. Alright, got it all. So, let's light this up. Wow, this is a weird and dangerous place. scary. Alright, so let's go back over here and where I first came down. Is this where I first came down? I don't know. I guess so. And as cool as this water looks, I think I'm going to block it off. I'm just going to block it though. I'm not going to get rid of it. So, there we go. And I will put a torch here. <laughs> and up near the surface here I will smelt my iron. 
I got coal and I got seven iron. Let's see. I really want another piece of iron. One more piece so that I'm not wasting a piece of coal. It's a little OCD of me, I guess, but here's one piece. And some coal to boot. So two pieces in fact. Alright. So and what I'll probably do is just do it right here instead. Mine out this coal. Cubby hole here. Burn, baby, burn. Let's get a torch down here. Make a sword. And what else do I need? I'll need an iron pickaxe too. So, almost got enough for that. Let's go ahead and make couple more sticks and if I got one more piece of iron I will make a shovel all right there we go so put a shovel there so now I'm gonna go down here just can't resist a good coal vein. I'm going to resist a little bit though. That's getting a little tedious. Some light going here. Now that's a little bit of a drop. But I've got full health and full food so it will come back. I just got to remember that this is There's some more iron right there. What I need is some skeletons. Oh. You almost snuck up on me, Mr. Spider. My first experience points of the day. Narrowly averted disaster there from the creeper but I'm still able to get around let me do this a slightly safer way there we go block that off
Ooh, there's gold in them there hills. Let me pull my iron pickaxe out to get that gold. I'm trying to remember what gold is used for. Uh, I know you make booster tracks with it, so but I don't think that it really has a use beyond that. Making a clock. That's about it. I'm sure there's other things you can do with it. Maybe there's some enchanting or some such thing you can do with it. But and here is a Did I get I got it spider eye. I don't really know what the spider eye is useful for. I think it's another kind of enchantment ingredient. This is a dangerous place. Well, getting down closer to where I want to be, let's see if I can't find some diamonds while I'm down here. So let's Mark this. And this is a another lava daily. Getting close to the diamond level. Oh, and I can hear slimes. Perfect. I just gotta figure out where they're at. Awesome. Sp slimes only spawn in very specific areas, so um, if you can find one, then you know you're going to be cool. that slime. Yes, slime balls. A multitude of slime balls. Wow. That's awesome. Is it cheat? No, it's. I've determined that it's not cheating. So 191, 181, roughly, uh, is where they're able to spawn. That's kind of a dead end. I was hoping I can, if you get down here close to where you're uh, right on top of the lava, you uh, can often just find diamonds in these caverns. So I'm going to kind of 
hunt around here and see if I can't find some easy diamonds. Take that, you evil monster. Oh, wow. Took care of that problem. And then there's water beyond that. So let me, let me go back here and get some of this lapis. Do I have? Yeah, I've got some empty spots here. Hmm. Well. Let me get some redstone while I'm at it. I like how the redstone breaks a lot faster. That was very annoying mining it. No diamonds over here. This is go this goes up. This just continues upward. Does it go back down over here? Yes, it does. Now I'm officially kind of lost. Spiders are kind of assholes. Huh. Is there any diamonds here? It seems to me, and I don't know if this is just... Oh, here we go. There's confirmation bias. But it seems to me that Diamonds are maybe just a little bit more rare, um, but I guess they aren't, but... It just seems like it's a little bit harder to find diamonds since uh, the 1.8 release, where they kind of change terrain generation, so... But like I said, that could be confirmation bias. Which is a logical fallacy if you're not familiar. Uh, it's like if you are. Uh, if you learn a new word, like discombobulated, for example, and then you're driving home and on the radio you hear someone use the word discombobulated you might think that there's some kind of uh, that it's not just random chance but it is and that's kind of you know if it happens several times to you then you might think you know I'm special in some way or I can predict the usage of words I don't know but um all that is is confirmation bias. You're, you're uh, not noticing all the other times that the word is used and you just haven't noticed it. Um, or you're not taking into account all the times that the word was used before you knew what it meant and just, you know, completely disregarded it because you didn't know what it meant. So, wow, seven diamonds already. Wow, that was a good, that was a good strike right there. That was a good, good strike. So, can I go this way? No, I can't go this way. That right there is one of the easiest ways, I think. Dig down, because um, lava... Let's see what level I'm on. Yeah. If, you, if your Y coordinate is 12, lava will be at ground level. Right there. Because lava pools at, at level 10. So, uh, if you come up on, you know, just steady... 
lava pools than ooh, an Enderman. Come here, you asshole. I teleported. Damn it. I think that they have no regard for the Y coordinate, so he very well could have teleported to the surface right there. So I have no clue where he went. I can hear another slime. <laughs> but I've already got eight slime balls, so that's that's a pretty good haul for slime balls. So maybe slime will be a little bit more uh, easy to get in Minecraft now. Oh crap! Crapola! Did you see that? Holy cow! Now I gotta go back down here and get all that junk. Wow. That was just, I was completely unprepared for that. My bed was missing or obstructed. What? Oh, yeah. I know what happened with that. So, gosh, which way do I go? I go this way. Um, yeah, I know what happened with that. So that's the bad thing about my little bed trick is that uh, you can't set your spawn using that method. <laughs> uh, it has it. it uh, there has to be a. It it's only works for sleeping. Uh, so there has to be a um, place for you to spawn around the bed, and there just w with that there's not. It's it's got to be kind of on the same level as the bed. So, uh, yeah, if you use that little bed method that I was using, uh, it's good for sleeping, but you can't set your spawn with it. And I, t I I've totally forgot about that until you know, of course, just now when it, uh, it's had it affected me. Uh, and now I've got to go back and find all my junk. I don't know if I'll even be able to find that stuff. That was I was way down in the middle of nowhere there. So. But yeah, that, that bed trick is, that's a good f thing to do on the first night, you know, to get yourself through, uh, to avoid being killed, you know, right off the bat, but uh, when, once you start to, you know, get some stuff going you need to uh, go ahead and make a proper house and put a bed in it and uh, where is this mine at I know I'm close there it is so I'm gonna have to be kinda quick so my junk doesn't disappear and I don't lose all my experience points and diamonds seven diamonds I hope none of them fell in any lava so we'll just go on down here, keep going down, keep going down, 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 and down, ow, down. I don't know where I went from here, of course, but I guess I can kind of guess. I've got to look for some... There's skeletons everywhere. Uh, so I'm just going to keep following. Did I come here? No. I think I'm going to lose all my stuff. <laughs> that is awesome. Not really. Gosh, get away from me, skeleton. Give me a freaking break. Oh, I got two of them after me now. I was hoping that they would follow me and go into the lava, but they didn't do it. Did I? I, I couldn't have come over here. I couldn't have come over here. So this is a dead end. 
And now I have to be even quicker because I followed a dead end. There it is. There's all my stuff. Ow. Screw you, skeleton. Did I happen to pick up my sword? Damn it. jump back then I saw an enderman over here I'm looking right at you asshole come here and get me come and get me food. Mm. Yes. So I'm just going to stand here <laughs> and let my energy build back up for a minute. around here. And I'm going to go over here. And, ah. I can hear I can hear... There he is. Ah, oh, crap! Not again. Shh, Nikes. Alright. Which way am I going? Load in world so I can figure this out. There we go. Yes. So I'm not having much luck. <laughs> the good thing is it's been daytime. Well, every time I've been killed. So I don't have to fight mobs to get back to my stuff. Like overland mobs. But I will have to fight mobs again when I get back down there. So it might actually be better for it to be dark outside. Maybe I should wait till dark and let some mobs spawn up here so that there's fewer mobs to deal with underground. Because I think that there's a kind of a limit to mobs. Uh, I, I think, uh, you know, they won't spawn more than a certain amount, so that if you can uh, get mobs to spawn in a certain area and then leave that area, fewer mobs will spawn later on. I don't know. But let's see. As long as you're within kind of the same area. Sorry, I had to adjust my headset there. And once again, I gotta find this cave. This is it here. 
And once again, I gotta go fight a bunch of spiders and Endermen and... Oh, man. This is no good. Uh, I was kind of hoping that I would survive that with a little bit more grace. Well, oh, I was so close to my... S Man, so close. And I got attacked. Oh man. Just get away from me, spider. Probably not gonna survive this. Oh, there's some food right there. I think I've got a lot. Oh, those things are fighting themselves. Good. Oh, get away from me. Get away! Where's my diamonds? Now, how do I get out of here? Without all these things killing me. Oh. Okay, I just gotta get back up there. So. Uh. Just gotta use some cobblestone here. And. I'm actually gonna. Do that, and then that kind of gives me a way down. Uh, here we go. Collect up my stuff. Do I need to use a pickaxe to get this thing? I don't know. I can't remember. I guess that makes it easier. So yeah, it's gonna be nighttime outside. Let me go try to sleep in my bed. Up on the hill. Gonna try to avoid these creepers. And that skeleton. Your skeleton. You're a real jerk. I mean I don't like you. See me, Mr. Creeper. Thank you. Uh, up, up, up the hill. Almost home. And there's a creeper up here. Get away, creeper. There we go. Alrighty, let's get up here and get to bed before anything else spawns. <laughs> like that zombie. Take that, zombie. Right on. So, as the new day dawns, uh, here in 1984, um, that's pretty much going to be it. I think that I will build a house. I might build it right down there. I don't want to be up on top of this hill. Maybe I do. I don't know. I'm going to leave an outpost up here, but I'm going to build a house, and I'll probably build it right down there. So uh, I'll leave my thing pointed there so maybe I'll remember. And that's all. Goodbye for now. Bye-bye.